Hello there guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we are looking at a massive game-changing update for the TDS GTN XI. If you fly helicopters in MSFS or X-Plane, this is the update you've been waiting for. We are talking about fully realistic HTAS helicopter terrain awareness and warning system and for the first time in any flight sim product full Navigraph integration for worldwide heliports and procedures. First, let's talk about the tech. Because the TDS GTN XI runs off the official Garmin PC trainer. What we are seeing here is almost 100% true to life logic. This isn't just a skin. The unit is actually running the real world code. This means the terrain coloring, the warning logic, and the voice alerts are exactly what real helicopter pilots experience. Terrain, terrain. Let's look at the H TAS. In fixed Caution. wing flying, warning. TAS terrain. warns terrain. you about terrain, but helicopters fly lower and tighter. The new update automatically detects you are in a helicopter and switches to H TAS mode. The coloring logic is different here. It's adapted for that low altitude environment to prevent nuisance alarms while keeping you safe from terrain and man-made obstacles. Speaking of obstacles, the database has been massively expanded. It now includes North American power lines and even oil rigs. But the second half of this update is equally huge. TDS has worked with Navigraph to bring official retrocraft data to the unit. Make sure you update to the latest cycle, 2511 at the time of making this video. Once you do, you'll see worldwide heliports marked with a magenta H. This is the first product to utilize the specific data set. It is not just the location, it's the frequencies and the specific helicopter procedures. You can now load a flight plan from a heliport to a heliport, complete with specific copter approaches. This combines the TDS data with Navigraph data seamlessly. There are some smart quality of life features too. When the unit detects a helicopter, it automatically changes the map orientation to latched at low speeds, which helps the orientation during hover. It also disables smart glide, which doesn't apply to helis, and automatically updates your ownership icon. So, let's put this all together. I have set up a scenario in a mountainous region. As we navigate through this valley, notice how the H-Taws paints the terrain. Relative to our altitude, it's actively keeping us aware of the canyon walls. And for the arrival, instead of guessing, we have a fully Caution. loaded approach terrain. procedure terrain. into the destination heliport. Caution. This update terrain. brings a level terrain. of professionalism terrain. to helicopter terrain. operations terrain. that we haven't terrain. seen before. Terrain. The best part? Warning. If you own Terrain. the Pro, Terrain. Pro Upgrade, or x version, Terrain. this update Terrain. is free. A huge thanks to the developer for continuing to push the boundaries of what this unit can do. Caution. Make sure to Terrain. grab the update, refresh your Navigraph data, and let me know in the comments what you think Caution. of this new HTAS features. Safe flying, folks!